What is up you guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Brenda Michelle. If you love everything home decor, then you're in the right place. If you're an oldie but a goodie, welcome back. Today I am sharing a huge home decor haul. This is probably my favorite haul. I know I've said that a million times, but you guys, this one, this one you want to get comfy because it's going to be a good one. So let's get started. But of course, as always, if you've never seen me before, hit that subscribe button and join the YouTube fam and go follow me over on Instagram and on TikTok, always linked down below. Let's start off with some Lazy Susans. I have been wanting these forever. I actually got my inspiration from, I know you guys are going to think this is so cliche, but Khloe Kardashian's pantry. I love it. I love the way that it's organized. She has like six of these Lazy Susans all just lined up next to each other and I love that. So I did order me six of these. I found these on Amazon. They're white on like gray. They are two of them. I do plan on ordering maybe two more to fit a total of eight all across my pantry. These were actually really good quality. I was able to fit a ton of stuff here on my Lazy Susan, some spices, some ketchup, some like syrup, things you keep normally in your pantry. So these are really good to have. I recommend you guys pick them up. They come in a ton of different colors. I've seen some like, like a taupey color. I know, I was surprised I didn't pick up the taupey color, but my kitchen, as you guys can see, it has a lot of like black accents, white, a lot of neutrals, but for the powder room, I do want to keep it just very clean and white. So that's why I chose to go with these. I will link them down below. I did pick me up a total of six, but here I only have two, just to kind of show you guys. Oh, and the little grip part is actually pretty good as well. Like none of my pieces are slipping and sliding, which I love. So whenever I'm in the pantry and I'm just spinning them around, everything stays in place. Okay. This is something that I have always looked for at Target, but I never come across, and I found them on Amazon. I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna get these. I always buy them separate, so why not get them all together on Amazon? I got them in the stainless steel. So these you can use for everything, you guys, for you know, making your eggs in the morning, making your pancakes. You can use them for everything. They come in a ton of different sizes. So let me take them out for you guys. This is, of course, the big one. Then it comes in the medium size, a smaller size, and a really, really small size. So whenever I'm making breakfast in the morning, if I'm dicing up some onions, some tomatoes, I put all of my, you know, ingredients in these guys. If I'm making some eggs, I'm making some pancakes, like I said, whether I'm baking, whatever it is that I'm doing, I love having these. They're super convenient. They come in a set of one, two, three, four, five. Five, I will link them on my Amazon storefront, but I will also link them for you guys down below. They have the best reviews in my opinion and when I got them I was very pleased with them I'm very happy with them and I recommend them to you guys so you're not buying them individually every time you go to the store just get yourself a whole packet just like this one that you can find on Amazon now moving on to tar Target yes Target like I said I want to keep my pantry organization very clean minimal aesthetic so I did pick up those lazy Susans and I picked up these guys from Target, I love these. Again, like I said earlier, I'm getting my inspiration from Miss Khloe Kardashian's pantry. I think her pantry is just like, pantry goals, like it's so perfectly organized. I'm like, I need to get my pantry on that level of like pantry organization. So I got these at Target. They're a glass penny candy jar, but of course you can use them for anything you want. I actually put like my oatmeal. I eat a lot of oatmeal in the morning, the little pack, like the little bags of oatmeal. I put these guys in here, or you can put cookies in here. You can put pretty much anything. Again, it says for candy. I don't eat candy. My son doesn't eat candy. None of us eat candy here in the house, but I use it for other things. So it's a really good size to have in your pantry. Of course, I love the stainless steel lid since a lot of ooh, the appliances in my kitchen are stainless steel. And then I picked up the smaller size. I actually washed this one out because I did have cookies in here. We finished them. I had some Chips Ahoy in here. My son ate them all, you guys. If I have cookies in the pantry, my son will eat them. So I wish they had more, like I was saying. So if I do come across some, I'm gonna definitely pick up like three more sets of these because I want to have them like back to back all laid out in my pantry. I'm telling you guys, once I have that pantry done, I cannot wait to film a video for you guys. And we're trying to recreate Miss Chloe's pantry here on a budget. Like, I'm sure she goes off and gets all of her pantry organization stuff from who knows where, but we're doing it the good old fashioned way, you know, going to Target and Amazon. So I'm gonna help you guys recreate that by getting these pieces off of Target and Amazon. Okay, moving on to Crate and Barrel. I have been going to Crate and Barrel. 
I got my coffee, you guys. It's not a haul, I don't have my coffee. It has been raining like crazy. Like if you live in Southern California, you know what I mean. It has been like hailing and snowing and I don't know, just the weather is crazy. Like mother nature is really giving us water and I'm here for it, but I'm also over it, you guys. I'm so ready for summer. Like I thrive in the summer. Like I am a summer person, so I am ready for summer. Like mother nature, you, you gotta, you, you need to stop. You know, but we needed water, like you guys know we needed water, so it is a good thing that it's raining, but I'm over it. Getting back to the haul. From Crate and Barrel, I've also been picking up a ton of kitchen stuff. I got these guys right here to store food. I got two of them, so this is a smaller size. It comes with a matte black lid, which obviously I liked. And then I got the bigger size. So both of these do come together. I did get these at the outlet, but I will try my best to find them for you guys, which I'm sure you can still find them over on the website. If not, they have a ton. Ooh, they have a ton of these that you can definitely purchase for yourself, but I will try to find these exact ones. I'm very happy with them. These are kitchen essentials that everybody needs in their house. And they weren't even that expensive, guys. I think I paid less than like $25 for both of them. I'm not sure how much they are on the website, but I will find out for you guys. Moving on to hand soaps. You guys know I like to keep it bougie with my hand soaps. I finally went up and picked myself some Aesop soap. I love this soap so, 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 so much. It smells amazing. I know these are a little bit more on the pricier side, but I promise you guys, one can last you a very long time. And if you maybe want to store them away, bring them out when you have guests over, you know, just to have the aesthetic, then I recommend you do that. Maybe get yourself a cheaper soap to use on a day-to-day -day basis. But you know, with me and my family, it's just three of us, so I don't mind having them out, you know, every single day. And they're still pretty cool. I got them about two weeks ago. I love this soap so much. I recommend it 100%. I will link it down below. And not much to say, the aesthetic is beautiful. They're a recent purchase of mine. I wanna pick up two more to put in my powder room. These are currently in my kitchen but I wanna pick up two more for my powder room. And if you've never tried it, I'm sure you've seen it everywhere, I recommend it. You will love it, I promise. Now, moving on to the fun stuff, which is the home decor I saved the best for last. This piece right here with these coasters were actually gifted to me from Crate and Barrel and Jake Arnold. Look at these coasters, you guys. Oh my gosh, I will link them for you guys down below. They are beautiful, stunning, I cannot believe that this was gifted to me by them. You guys, let's talk about the event really quick. I know you guys know that I love to talk, so I won't chat it up for too long, but I feel that in my last video, I didn't really express how I felt being there because I was still in my feelings, you guys. Getting to go to an event with Crate and Barrel was such a surreal moment for me. It was such a full circle for me. You guys know that I've been loving Crate and Barrel and CB2 forever now. I've been shopping with them for years and to get to be at an event with them, it was, again, something that I dreamed of for so long. And little old me got to be there and meet a ton of interior designers that I look up to day to day. I got to meet Eric Garcia, which you guys might know by Mason Chuve. Like, we talked it up. We shared our passion for interior design, and he was amazing. Like, I cannot express how humble this man is in person. I'm excited to get to see him again. He's gonna have a little pop-up shop in LA that I'm hoping I get to go to. And of course, I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I got to obviously meet Jake Arnold, the designer of the collection. He was amazing as well. We chatted it up. He told me how long the collection took for him to you know, design and what his favorite pieces were. And he was also just amazing. And just being there with Crate and Barrel, like it was a dream come true. And of course, if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't get to experience these things. And I am truly, 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 truly grateful from the bottom of my heart. I cannot express to you guys how grateful I am for those of you who support me day to day on every single one of my platforms. Like if it wasn't for you guys, little old me would not have been there. And it was, like I said, a dream come true. I cannot believe it. I got to meet the like social media, like the marketing team for Crate and Barrel. They were amazing. They were the sweetest ever. Like it was just amazing. It was amazing. And one thing that I got to, you know, talk to Eric about that I was like, oh my God, it, I just, it lit up something in me that I wanna continue to do this even more. Like it just got me even more excited, you know, to continue my journey here with you guys. And one of the things was that he said, you know, these interior designers get to work with big 
you know, stars. Like he's currently working with Adrian Baylon on her New York, I believe it's like a like an apartment or like a townhome. I'm not sure what it is, but either way, oh my gosh, it looks beautiful already. And he told me that a lot of the times they're not able to tag the pieces or where they find this, these pieces because, you know, they have these customers that are paying top dollar for you know these interior designers to come to their home and create a beautiful space so i told them that i like to share my home and help you guys you know create a look for your home without having to go and hire an interior designer. And these pieces, I am helping you guys curate them from Target, from Crate and Barrel, from Amazon, from anywhere that you guys can get your hands on. And he was like, you keep doing that. He's like, that's amazing. And to hear it from him, that he's such an inspiration of me, it just, it, it meant a lot. And I you know, told him that I, I love the community that I have and I'm gonna continue to do what I love. And I cannot wait to maybe one day be able to create my own piece that you guys can have in your homes. And I just, I don't know, it just really, it meant a lot to me to be there. And again, you guys, thank you so much for continuing to support me in my journey. And if it wasn't for you guys, I would not have got to be at that event. So thank you so much to you guys. And thank you to Korean Barrel for inviting me to go to the event. And again, they gifted me these coasters right here, which is so beautiful. I'll link them down below. You guys can actually go and check out the entire Jake Arnold collection, which is available now over on their website. Moving on to the rest of the home decor pieces, you guys. I am so excited for these pieces. Oh my gosh, like you guys have no idea. So let's start off with this footage bowl. Speaking of interior designers, one of my favorite interior designers is definitely Athena Calderon. I love how her style is very modern, very organic. Like she brings a lot of earthy vibes into her interior design and it's just beautiful. And I went a little crazy. I created and barrel and picked up a ton of new home decor pieces for my home, which you guys know that I have not been doing that recently because I've been focusing on other things like furniture and renovations, but I could not, I could not not buy these pieces. So this footed bowl right here, look how beautiful it is. I do have my lemons in here for now. I want to add more lemons, but I love this. It is such a beautiful piece. You can use it as decor or you can use it in your kitchen. I have it right now in my kitchen with my lemons, but I could totally use it as a decor piece on a shelf, on a console table, on a coffee table. So I recommend you guys pick it up. Look how beautiful the texture is, the color. It's to die for. I love it. It doesn't say, no, it doesn't say the price on it, but I will definitely link it down below for you guys. It is from Crate and Barrel. Another piece that I picked up. These are all pieces from the Athena Calderon collection, which I am obsessed with you guys. I love, I cannot wait to show with you guys my dining chairs. They are from her collection, but they're so backed up, you guys. Everything is just so back ordered with their furniture. This piece right here, look at this. Oh my gosh, how could I leave this behind? This is stunning, I love the design to it. You guys can definitely see that she took her time with every single piece. You, I think you could totally put flowers in this. I mean, it is a vase, but I don't know, maybe some dry florals. I would definitely put like some dry florals in here. That'll look really, really pretty. Or even on its own on top of a coffee table book, this will look beautiful. I freaking love it. And I know you guys will love it too. And then last from her collection, let me get it, you guys. It is massive. Oh, the milk. <laughs> How gorgeous is this big vase, you guys? Okay, so you could totally put whatever flowers you want in this guy or just leave it alone. It would look so beautiful on its own as well. I actually removed my flowers that I had in my little entryway table. And you guys will get to see how I styled it over on my TikTok. So follow you on TikTok. And I added this beautiful vase there with some coffee table books. And again, you guys, I recently expressed over on my Instagram that I cannot wait to get all of my furniture so I can start decorating with you guys. So go and follow me over on Instagram and TikTok. I am sharing a little bit of decor over there for now, but I would definitely bring my YouTube fam some new decor content real soon. But these pieces I loved. I picked them up from Crane Barrel. They're from the Athena Counter on Collection. So check them out. I will link them down below. Lastly, from Amazon, I picked up this little guy right here. I got it to put next to my soaps. So I have my soaps over on my kitchen and I got this little guy, kind of like a catch-all so I can put my rings in there when I'm washing the dishes. I like it, you guys have seen this guy here on my channel before. I have the smaller one, now I have the big one. And last but not least, I hope you guys are still hanging out with me. I could not wait to share this with you guys here on this haul. I do have an entire video 
over on my TikTok that will be going up if it's not up yet, because this video will be going up on Sunday. So if it's not up yet, it will definitely be going up this week where I will style these curtains with you guys. These are from two pages. Huge shout out to two pages for working with me over on my guest bedroom and my son's bedroom. They have the most beautiful drapery curtains ever. The quality is amazing. They are so beautiful. I would definitely link the ones that I got down below, the color, the pleated style that I got. Everything fit perfect, you guys. You go on their website, you type in the sizing you want, the length you want, the material you want, everything you want your curtains to look like and they will send them to you. And I got them so quick. I received them within two weeks. I recommend it, you guys. And drapery could be super expensive. These were super affordable and I love them. You guys know I will definitely be bringing you guys an entire video once I have the, all the drapery set up here in my house and how you can definitely save some money and get that high end look by picking these up for your home. All right, you guys, and that completes today's video. I told you it was gonna be a good one. Probably my favorite haul in a while. I know you guys love hauls, so I'm sure you guys really enjoyed this one. Give it a huge thumbs up if you will be picking up some of these pieces for yourself. Everything will be linked down below in the description box. And of course, as always, follow me over on Instagram and on TikTok. Stay up with me day to day. And again, you guys, thank you for always showing up for me. I truly, truly appreciate it. Until next time, stay warm, because it is cold, you guys. It is cold. I'll catch you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys.